Good morning, YouTube Alonia. That's the term I've coined for the land of YouTube, where it's inhabited by YouTube Alonians such as yourselves. I'm fully awake today because I'm flying out to New York City. A new experience for me. Yes, I am a pilot. I bet some of you didn't know that. I don't film much as a pilot because, well, I'm a little busy at that time. And it's also, uh, you know, my profession, so, and I don't really share a whole lot about that. So I'm hoping that uh, I get some free time when I get out there today, because uh, I'm flying back tomorrow, so total work time for the most part. But I'm going to get a little free time, maybe take you downtown to see what's going on in downtown New York for the quickest tour uh, that a guy could ever have. Hey YouTube, I'm in Morristown, New Jersey. I flew in here this afternoon, and uh, when you fly, you know where you're at all the time, with GPS and all the avionics and things. But as soon as you're on the ground in a hotel with no car, no GPS, well then, no idea where you are. So I'm gonna get some train and go down to New York. I don't know, we'll just uh, wing it, I guess. I guess the train takes me right to Times Square. So, here we go. South Orange, Melville Station, Highland Avenue, Orange, Ruth Church, East Orange, Newark Broad Street, and Penn Station, New York. Please stand back from the yellow line. Please watch the gap between the train and the platform. Oh, you need a ticket? Yeah. All right. I'm definitely a newbie. Didn't know I needed a ticket out. Okay. So, um, I landed here in Morristown. And got into the hotel without a car. Don't know where I am. I just, I know I'm west of New York City. So the hotel people said, just walk down Elm Street and get on the train. It's that easy. You just get on the train and you go to New York City. Who knew? <laughs> this is so fun. So here we go. I'm uh, just exploring New York. Not knowing what I'm doing. Don't have a car. Don't have a map. Nothing. I'm just going to go down to Times Square and check it out. We'll see what we find. You want to come along?
cannot believe it's this easy to just get right downtown New York. It just rained right when I got here on the train and the sun is starting to set and it just makes it gorgeous down here. Oops, can't text or walk down here. Is this Central Park already? I don't think so. Can't be. Okay, this is Bryant Park. Uh, not Central Park. <laughs> Central Park's much larger than this. Okay, just down the way there's Radio City Music Hall. And it is far more beautiful than I've ever seen in photos. I gotta get down there and Instagram this. Here comes the bus load of tourists. I guess I'm a tourist too. But I'm by myself, so nobody knows that I'm a tourist. I can pretend like I work down here and know what I'm doing, right? This is just amazing. You just walk every block and you recognize just about everything. Oh, I gotta go in here. <laughs> There you go. I don't watch much TV at all, but this is one show I do watch. Well, with a quick self-guided foot tour, such as what I'm doing, I gotta keep moving. So this is Rockefeller Plaza. That is part of Rockefeller Center. And uh, right here, people, is where that Rockefeller Christmas tree is placed. Only in New York City can a guy from Fargo walk around downtown talking to himself and nobody even looks. <laughs> Okay, so I didn't know I was coming downtown New York, but what is that building? Because I didn't have time to look it up. There we go, that's my Instagram shot right there. There's nothing like being in Times Square, not knowing you're in it. I thought it was like a building. So I'm walking around this place asking people where's Times Square and they're like, they don't know how to answer this thing. Nobody said you're there. <laughs> I thought it was a building I'm supposed to be looking for. It's a whole region. Hey, I've seen this in photos. Where have I seen this? Tell me a comment. Okay, this must be Central Park. Just up ahead here. Amazing. Just came out of the city down there, got to Central Park, and it is tranquil. It's an amazing feeling. You just walk out of all that city, and all of a sudden, within a block, it's just tranquil. This is amazing, you guys. Truly amazing. Hello, YouTube Balonians. I'm in Central Park, downtown New York City, and I can't believe I'm here. It really wasn't a plan. But I'm a pilot, as you may or may not know, and I take occasional flights to places that are actually exciting, rather than just, you know, Minneapolis and Bismarck and other places that are, ah, I guess they're exciting too. But. So I made it downtown, obviously. Didn't even know I was in Times Square. I'm going around asking people in the region of Times Square. I guess it's a great big neighborhood of New York. Uh, if that's the right way to explain it. I'm going around asking people, where's Times Square? I thought it was a building. It shows you how much I know. But I didn't know I was coming to New York until last week. So I really didn't have any prep time to get ready for this trip. And uh, here I am, downtown New York, without any plan. The fact that this is as quiet as my backyard is just amazing to me. I'm standing just half a mile from New York City. So I finally meet a creature that eats as much as Sadie does. Look at this guy chow down. 
He can't even see me. Boy, I'll tell you what. New York City's a place you don't want to step out on the street. Oh, we're near 42nd Broadway, which I found out from my dad. Uh, you can stop in and buy rush tickets for any show going on the day that you're there. So these characters uh, are not free. You gotta pay to take a picture of them, but it's voluntary. I guess they can't make you pay. You can feel the heat coming off of all of these advertisements, and these screens and things. It's crazy. Hey, you Tubalonians, check out this busload of tourists. They're getting the grand tour here. Oh, and they're waving to Frosty Life fans. How about that? They're waving to all of you guys. Hello, Frosty Life. Yay! Well, there's my ride. Time to head home. Well, time to get my train back home and get to sleep. I've walked many miles tonight. I believe I found the station on my own without even using GPS. It's right here. So I headed on the train, the New Jersey Transit train, and headed right down in the heart of New York, Times Square, Central Park, saw all that stuff. It was so easy. I was amazed at how easy it is to get down there and walk around safely. You don't need a car, you don't need a cab. You just ride the train down to Grand Central Station. So stay in a place like the town I stayed in was Morrisville. And that's west of uh, like Newark, I think. Um, it's in New Jersey. And the train ride was an hour and a half in. Don't let that scare you. It's only 12 bucks to get in, into New York. It takes you right straight into Penn Station. Who's glad I'm home? Who's glad? Who's happy? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You sound like a piglet. Is it a piglet? Go outside. I'll go play. Are you happy at home? Mm -hmm. People of YouTube, welcome to my channel. The world is mine.